So the, the pre-market of the beast is happening right now. Whole food about to implement that barcode for your arm. Amen. So if you put your arm, your right arm, on a certain device, it pays your bills. My friend, we got to wake up and realize that God is on his way back. Jesus Christ is coming. Yes, Jesus Christ is coming. And the reason why he's coming because we see stores are implementing the mark of the base. Amen. We see how LGBTQ is on the rise. We see uh, same-sex marriage. We see transgender, that, that people are changing their sex. They become, they want to be creator. They say God made a mistake. And now they become God. Listen, Jesus Christ is coming. And if you're not ready, ready or not, he's coming. Look at, the, look at the foolish virgins. The foolish virgins are people that's, that's in church, but church is not in them. They think that God has come back for brick and mortar. God ain't come back for a brick and mortar. God come back for a church with a spot or wrinkle. What that mean, preacher? That mean that God come back for a glorious church. God come back for a church that was ready to be raptured. See, the foolish church virgin Got a dash to ask those wise virgins, give us some of your oil. My oil is not meant to be to be to be parted to you. You have opportunity, amen, to receive the oil. You have opportunity to confess with your mouth, believe in your heart that God has raised him from there, thou shalt be free. You have opportunity to receive the Holy Ghost as Acts 2 36, repent and be baptized, every one of you. For the remission of sins, and ye shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. So, Jesus is coming. And a lot of people are still playing church. A lot of people don't want to be in the presence of the Lord. A lot of people don't want to receive the present, which means receive the free gift of salvation. You ain't got to buy it. The only thing God wants you to do is invite him into your life. Invite him into your house. Hey, glory to God. Jesus, you invited my house. Hey, glory to God. Don't invite demons. Invite Jesus Christ into your house and he will save you from your sin. Jesus is coming.